of John Deere trucker cap on the Upper East Side hipster's head brought it all back. The yellow rim tractor wheels that were taller than me, the smell of hay and grass, the farm. What did these people know of the land, of tilling, planting, and tending, of how those Atkins friendly meals reached their plates? And the girls with their long hair, a symbol of fertility, grown here in the sterile bubble of a city so far removed from nature's bounty, sold away by Native Americans for a few dollars trying to follow the white man's rules. And the white men continue to green the pockets of all of us here on the Upper East Side, in a city where women parade for coats like it's the day after hunt, where fake breasts and tightened jaws are traits endorsed by dead presidents, Grants and Benjamins rolling in their graves. Where I came from, freedom meant open skies and fields to run in, a place to laugh, scream, cry, with no one to hear you but the one who made all of that. Here, freedom seems something bought and sold, something sopped up with bread held between pudgy fingers, the last drops on an American plate. I wonder if it's possible to unlearn what one's seen, to remember what one knows, that John Deere hats were meant to shield farmers' eyes while moving a green tractor over brown land.